breaking news. UN government urges Buhari government to release the IPOP leader, Mazin Namde Kano, before the next court appearance on November 2022, says the Nigerian government should apply political solution to IPOP leader Mazin Namde Kano's case. Okay. So now now they they break. Anyway, Sha, me I know they trust these people. Because all these things have been happening here and there and here. They kept silent. They have refused to talk. They know the history of what has been happening in Nigeria. But they just decided to keep quiet because all of them they work hand to hand. You understand? President Muhammadu Buhari will not still listen. This is not the first time they have been advising Mazin and the Kano. Uh, I beg your pardon, they have been advising President Muhammadu Buhari about the IPOP leader's case and all that. But he kept adamant. And nobody is questioning him about that. But these, the same governments, Nigerian governments, are giving amnesty to terrorists in Nigeria. We are talking about people who have killed thousands of Nigerians, who have made millions of Nigerians homeless. These people have made life horrible for Nigerians and all that. President Muhammad Buhari did not see this, you know, as not normal for giving these people amnesty and all that. We have never heard anywhere these presidents are, are persecuting bandits in this country. This is really very, very unfair. These agitators, what, what, what brought agitator, agitation to this country? Is it not because of their bad governance that brought them on board? They have refused to look into the roots of agitation, but decide to be going after agitators. And this is why they are getting it wrong. Holding Mazin Namdekano is not going to solve any problem. The best thing is sit in a round table and discuss with these people because you are not just going to keep quiet to say Mazin Namdi Kano and the IPOB agitators, they just want to cause problems in Nigeria. They are not saying, in fact, they are talking blah, blah, blah. That is not true. Are we going to say that these people, they are not being marginalized? Even the body language of the government he is, is, is reading, written boldly on the wall. You understand? There is no two way about it. They are evil leaders. They know why they are not talking. Because they feel that they are comfortable in their little space. So they don't care about the masses. So anybody who is agitating for freedom and, and all that, you are on your own. They can even tell the president, say, see as you go take deal with them. Because they don't want to leave their comfort zone. Coming back to the UN. Who is asking President Muhammad Buhari to release Mazin Namdi Kano or apply political solution that that is the best solution to use now? Mazin Namdi Kano is now in uh, is about a year and now in DSS detention since the Nigerian government adopted him from unknown country. And you know why I use that unknown country because the Kenya government have said that. Namdi Kano was not arrested in their country. So it's only President Mamadou Buhari and uh, AGF Malami, Abubakar, mm -hmm. AGF, that knows where they brought Mazen Namdi Kano from. Though Namdi Kano said he was, you know, adopted from Kenya, but the Kenyan government said Mazen Namdi Kano was not arrested from Kenya, contrary to what President Mamadou Buhari government is saying. Since all this time, these people have kept mute about his extraordinary redemption to Nigeria, the torture and all that, they have kept mute. Maybe they are saying this one now because people don't do the talk. One and another talk put for this matter and all that. Would they, would they even put force on it? They know that Buhari will not listen. That is the truth. Buhari will not listen. He has decided to keep Mazin and Kano in the custody, maybe when he don't come up for office, he will leave the matter for another president. You know why? Because the government, Nigerian government knows that they have no case against the IPOB leader. So what they are just doing right now is trying to buy 
by time. How can you adjoin case for three months? Wait till now they think. Wait till now they plan. This matter, you know, if, if now really no say this man offend you now, according to President Muhammad uh, Buhari, that Mazina de Kano said some uncomplimentary words against the Nigerian government. That was, that was what he told Boris Johnson in Rwanda. And this is the same person who said is he cannot interfere in judiciary matter, that Mazina de Kano should answer his father's name in the court. So that means let the court def, uh, decide Mazina de Kano's uh, case or fate. Uh, faith, I beg your pardon. The same person they talk, they put because they don't already arrange and say, Nam the Kano, they not go release them. They know. So they are trying to buy time, made them wrong come out. This is really very bad. That the Nigerian government keep on going after agitators, but they do nothing about bandits and Boko Haram. Fulani has men. AK 47 is their ID. That is what they use to identify them. It's not a crime against the Nigerian constitution. But anybody who tries to carry that gun to defend himself, you are in trouble. The government will come after you. They will tell you that it's not normal. It's against the constitution. You cannot do that. We have the, the Nigerian military, we have the police that will do that. But where then they? The, the, the truth is that these people have an agenda and that is what they are trying to accomplish so mazen and the Kano becomes their greatest enemy for exposing some stops against the government so they are now seeing mazen and the Kano like your crime is unforgivable we cannot forgive you you know for cutting short our plans and all that but the truth the, the truth remains you cannot run away from your sin, no matter how smart you try to be. If you don't repeat today, tomorrow you will get it. So guys, what's your take concerning this? Let's hear from you. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you very much for always having you here. Bye for now.